members of Metro 01 and IMAC 04 Old Students Association of College of Education at Kadolo, we are in Okada to felicitate with their old school mates, Mr. Colin Subberwi, for the feat he attained as the executive chairman of Ofian North's local government. Describing Mr. Ogbewi as a dedicated member of the association who handle issues of the group with utmost importance, they express optimism that the local government chairman will not only deliver dividends of democracy to his people, but surpass the expectations of everyone. The group's pledge to work with the council boss to ensure his aspirations and desires for his people are actualized by partnering with him to attract the needed development to the locality. First of all, we want to say congratulations. We want to congratulate you for this job. Initially, when we saw you as a liaison officer, we knew within us that that was just the springboard to this position. And this is just a stepping stone. We know you are going higher. We are so happy that this generation that we are, as Metro, as friends, as colleagues, as classmates, as schoolmates, will be able to bring about the change that our people need in the society. Speaking earlier, the chairman of your office local government area, Colin Sugberwe, appreciated his old school classmates for identifying with him, pointing out that it is a thing of joy to see them together again after many years. He described his feeling as nostalgic. During our time, this basic education came on board and we were able to, to maintain that standard, to work in line with the directive of the government. Whenever I see my people in fact, I'm always, I'm always happy. So it was very really easy, but yeah. all the same, just to thank God for everything. And the person I recognize one of the best mathematicians in my class then, I <laughs> The groups presented a special congratulatory card to Mr. Colin Subberry. Present this to you. Earlier, the council boss held a security meeting with security heads in the local government area, along with other stakeholders, to boost security network to cover vulnerable areas in the locality, especially during the Yule tide. Sharon Ajayi, ITV News.